All right, so I'm over here at a customer's house we did a couple months ago. Um, we uh, basically came out, um, it was actually two years ago, I think that it was, that we actually came out and assessed this guy's pond. Um, came up with a really good solution, an idea of what to do with it. And it's kind of been put on pause for a while. You know, life, life gets in the way, other projects. Um, but what's interesting is uh, this is downtown San Marco. And so this entire property, I'm gonna show you here. So basically, um, this entire house got flooded up to kneecap height. So as you're looking at the doorstep there, yeah, there was like another 12 inches on top of that of water that came in um, during Irma. So it, it's really unfortunate that basically um, every house from this point down, downhill towards the river was completely flooded. So certain houses that were big, um, taller um, thrived and other ones didn't. Um, but what's interesting is before they're done, you know, this place is actually under construction. The homeowners don't even live here right now. So before this house is even complete, um, we actually get the opportunity to come out here and build the pond. So I just wanted to take an opportunity to show you guys just another one of our projects um, and, and show you kind of the importance where homeowners um, value their ponds. So here we've got a small one. I didn't believe Sean did this one about a month ago or so. Uh, it's a rebuild, so I should hopefully have some pictures of the befores for you guys. Um, but yeah, take a look at it. It's pretty cool. Sean did a great job with this one. Uh, it's a little shallower. Um, what's interesting is we ran into a huge amount of um, bald cypress roots kneecaps. These, these are the ones that put up the knees, and they were running all across this side of the pond, and that was actually the biggest problem with the existing pond is having problems with it punching, pun punching through. So yeah, just check this out. I love that little face on there. We even added a little pot here to the side, give it a little extra dynamic. It's a great, great viewing point. Of course, there's huge construction going on right now, but great viewing point for when they come out in their backyard, get to enjoy the space with um, the kids.